Good morning, I farm. Welcome to today's vlog. Me and Isabel are stuck. It's such a sunny day today. It's so nice. I, like I don't so know nice. why, but I just walked out the house. I'm like, no, that's a lie. I looked out the window and I was like, where's my beach towel? Get me that sun cream. So <laughs> Get nice. a cocktail in my hand. And then I walked outside and I was like, oh, it's a bit chilly today. Mm. <laughs> so it's, it definitely looks warmer than what it actually is. But that's not dampening our spirits because today, me and Isabel, Heading to the salon. Uh -huh. I'm not having my hair cut because I had my hair cut a couple of days ago. Nope, not a couple of days like ago. A week ago. It was about a week and a half ago. But I've already just had my hair cut recently. But I am getting my brows done, hence why I've got no eyebrows on today. I've got <laughs> no product on my eyebrows. Nada, nothing. This is just raw eyebrow. So I'm having mine waxed and tinted. Isabel's having hers just waxed. Yeah. And Isabel's having her hair cut as well. Yay. So, are you excited? Yeah, I'm so excited. I'm really excited. We actually, we actually have plans this afternoon over our friends, which Jace and Mila are so excited for because she's got a two-year-old daughter and a boy's same age as Jace. So they're gonna have the best afternoon playing. I actually want to call up the shops to get like a little, not like a present, but you know when you go to someone's house, like when they came to our house, they brought like gifts, Easter eggs, cake, etc. And when I messaged last night saying, what can we bring? She's like, nothing, because a husband's cooked like baked like Loads an actual <laughs> like Victoria sponge cake so they've got dessert covered usually I'd have taken dessert we're having pizzas they've made the dough we're creating our own pizzas so the food's taken care of um so other than like maybe like a few giant bags of crisps for, as snacks and then like I thought I could get the kids like I don't know some bubbles for the garden or, mm -hmm. you know just something to play with I hate going anywhere empty-handed mm -hmm. I hate walking and being like just, just being empty handed, I just, I don't know. I, I like taking something. So we're gonna call it Home Bargains or b and We'll call it B&M. Mm. <gasps> You've not been to new B&M? No, I've been to Oh, it's massive, yes. Although I did tell Dad we'll be about an hour. So turn into, that's gonna turn into three though if we go there. We'll make the most of it though. <laughs> right, let's go. Mama's eyebrows done. Aurora's a good girl. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy with them. They look so much better. Izzy's just having hers done now. Which is about having hers done. <laughs> yeah, if my son's, if, if he's going anywhere, I'll be like, feel a little bit of Yeah. <laughs> right, we just finished up in the hair salon. Isabel. Mm. Look how short her hair is. It looks, it's so nice though. It's so, so it's cute. It's got the longest, not longest, sorry, shortest layers. Sorry, Amara. Ever, let's get inside. Yeah, I can't really. Okay, as well, just said, did we have to come up the beer aisle? <laughs> so it's the only aisle with no one on here. But there we go. Yeah, it looks so nice. So sweet, so nice. So short, it's the shortest it's ever probably been. Ever. Ever. I think about it the shot ever. It looks really cute. You I like absolutely it? love it. Look at Aurora. She keeps smiling at me, I think she likes it. Mwah. Isabel, if you get any money, it's bad for your insides. Very bad. What I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to ID with the till. No, I'm going to have to trim my tattoos out. I'll get my tattoos out because I didn't ID me last time I did that. I'm, I'm not sure tattoos are class as ID. No, I don't no, think no. tattoos are going to No, I didn't say be hearing my tattoos. I mean, I just I just had them on display and she didn't ID me. Oh. But other times she has ID'd me. Is it but, last time, but, last time, but last time I got thingied. I mean, sorry, last time I made sure like you could see my tattoos and she, was, she didn't say anything. Right. So I'm saying it's good luck. <laughs> Did you get what? served, Isabel? I oh, know. Did you get served for your drink? No. Why not? Because I was too scared. So I asked <laughs> you to buy me. <laughs> that was actually the most stressful pain experience I think I've ever had. So she scanned my items and then she went, oh no. Oh. So she swore. She was like having this big meltdown at the till. And I was like, what? And she went, where's the lady? Where's the lady? And I was like, huh? And then she ran out the shop. And I was like, what's going on? And it turns out that the lady in front of me, she'd not charged her. So basically she'd scanned her shopping and then they were talking about something else, something to do with something. I'm not sure what, cause obviously I wasn't listening. I'm not sure what they were talking about, but they were talking about something. And then she obviously just went, okay, thanks very much. The lady picked the shopping up and left, but she'd not actually said that's however much it was, please. So when she scanned my shopping, she realized the amount didn't add up to what I'd bought and then realized she'd not charged. So then she came back in and the woman came back in. She, she ran out, managed to get hold of the woman. The woman came back in the shop to pay. 
Um, and then the one was like, this is the worst day of my life. <laughs> like proper having a meltdown, bless her. She's obviously not having a good day today. Um, and then she took all mine off, got it all back out the bag, put it back on the conveyor belt. And then she started having another meltdown about something. She's like, she called for the manager. Meanwhile, I'm just like, that till's empty. Can I just take my stuff, please? And pan that till instead. She was like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So then she starts getting my stuff and throwing it to the woman on the other side of the till. And then she scanned my stuff. She was a bit I paid. She? I picked up my bag to catch it. Wait, wait, wait. Can I have your stuff back? And I'm like, huh? She's like, I need to know. I need to know what I'm taking back off this bill. So I'm like, oh, she's like rummaging in the bag. Thing. She's like rummaging from my bag, going, what did I scan? What did I scan? And it was like the bubbles. And anyway. No biggie, no biggie. So, what we got to take with us is some high sweet chili sensations. Do you want to bang those, really Aurora? Hungry. You're really hungry. We got some mature cheddar and chili shutters. Chutney. What? I've got a question. Go on then. But you have to drive us there. So, you've got a question, but I have to drive. Can we go to McDonald's? No, we're not going to McDonald's. We're being healthy. A, I'll, okay, I'll don't say I'll buy you a cheeseburger because I'll cave and I don't want one. No, no, I don't want nuggets. I'm being good. We're going for pizza tonight. No. That's already bad enough. I'm being good. I'm not doing it. Um, I got some pretzels. I just there's, I, there's nothing I needed to take. I just you know what? I just wanted to take something. I got a pack of bubbles for the kiddos, and then I got a little car for Jace's or oh, truck, whatever this is. Jace's friend. I got a little truck for Jace. The purple one, that's his favourite colour. I'm sorry guys, but I can't cope with my little mama. She's the cutest thing ever. Right, <laughs> and then for Mila and her friend, we got a cute little unicorn fairy for her friend. We got a cute little pink one for Mila. And then we got some coins. We got you, um, some fairy ones for Mila and her friend and some dinosaur ones for Jason, his buddy. And that's all I'm taking, because they told me not to bring anything. Oh, Isabel! <laughs> Sorry, I'm and it's now me. all just piled on Aurora. Should we put it all back in the bag? Put it in the bag. <laughs> Guys, I just walked in. I just walked in and look at these two. Sat waiting patiently. You've been waiting for us to get home. Where are we, are we going to see? Where are we going? Where are we going? My friend's house. Are we going to see your friends? Yeah! Jace, you look like an absolute cool dude today. Stand up and show me that outfit. That is the coolest cool dude outfit I've ever seen. I like my super shoes. What's this? A car. What? What's this? A car? My lad did not light up. My, only mine lights up. That's what she said. Watch this. It can't. Mila's got some little boots on that I didn't actually think would fit her because she's slowly going into a size 6 and these are a size 5 but they absolutely do fit and she will not take them off for you. No. She's had them on all morning. No, 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 no. Huh? No, no. Come back down, we're going. No. We're going to your friend's house. No. You not want to go? No. Bye then. <laughs> Come on, let's go get in the car. Jace, your water. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Speedy boy. Woo, let's go. Guys, is there a leap at six months? Because this girl is just not the one. You're not the plumbing one. <laughs> she is so fussy. You were yesterday, weren't you? And you have been today. And when I say fussy, she has like a happy hour on a morning when she first wakes up. What is she has like a happy hour on a morning when she first wakes up. And then just, she just wants to be on you for the rest of the day. Fly kick. She just wants to be held, don't you? She doesn't want to go down. She doesn't want to do anything. Um. Anyway, good morning, guys, from me. This morning, me and Mila, ow, 
And Aurora had a lovely little kitchen disco this morning with breakfast. I made myself some celery juice, which was a very, very nice. And then, and then I went upstairs and got ready. He's smiling now. Um, all swell, Daddy and JC boy. Was it the opticians? Have you filled everyone in on the opticians? No, the result, no. Oh, no, I did. Well, yeah, briefly I did, but not like... Today's a two-in-one vlog because we didn't film anything yesterday much um, because we went out to our friends last night. We had such a lovely evening. I'm not going to lie. What time did we get home this morning? One o'clock. <laughs> got home at like 1 a.m. this morning. Oh, my gosh. We just were chatting and just loving the company and it was just such a nice night. It was such a lovely evening. That we got home super late, didn't we? Hello. We, we stopping out last night. Yeah. Hey, where are we? I love you. Um, so it's gonna be a two in one today. We're just getting ready now. We're taking Isabel out for a lunch free. We said if you could do anything whilst the girls are away, what would you like to do? And she said she'd like to go out for lunch with me and dad. Yeah. So we're taking her out for lunch. Um, the girls are actually home tomorrow, which is so exciting. I've just spoken to the mum that they've gone with and she just like, they're, they're, I'm not sure what time they're gonna be home, but it'll probably be like late afternoon. So it's so, so sweet. Isla sent me this adorable message. If you follow me on Instagram, you will already know this because I posted it to my story. But it's so sweet. She sent me a message yesterday. Was it yesterday? Just saying, do you know when you go to nursery and you get that feeling like you just want your parents? That's how I feel, like I'm having the best time. I'm having such an amazing time. But I just miss you and daddy, me and Ezzy. She calls her Ezzy. Me and Ezzy miss you and daddy. It's just so sweet. Um, they've never, it's just such a big deal that they've gone away because they just, we don't have like places that they go to sleep over. They never ever sleep out. We're always together. Other than like the odd friend when they go for like a sleepover at friend's house. But even then, that's just like, usually they come here. Our friends often come here, yeah. Most of the time, friends come here. There's always, in every friendship, or like every family, there's always a family that kids go sleep at someone else's house. Or they can yeah. always come to our house. Although, our friend, because our friends are like family friends, it's not just like, it's not like, it's not just like a school friend, so it's just like, it's just like a school friend. It's like family friends that have children around the same age, so they all just play together, obviously. Yeah. Um, so it's like split, so sometimes they come here, but yeah, often they come here. Anyway, my point is, is that they don't go anywhere. They're always with us. So the fact that when they do go places, it's just usually for a night and it's usually with a family friend, but they're really excited. They've had the best time. They've sent me messages every single day and they've had a great time. And we're gonna enjoy our last day without them, aren't we? So I think we're gonna go out for some lunch now. Look at my um, sleighs today. We got Jace River slaying his 80s style tracksuit. We've got Mila Roosevelt, looking so sweet in her little dress. Stand up, Mila. She's got her beautiful dress on that looks so cute. You know and that's getting wind blasted right now. No, it's not, it's not. And then we've got Isabel, slay all day in. Slay all day. all day. You're looking out the window, Mila. Yeah. What's out there? Um, cars and shops. Cars and shops. No, not cars. Cars, cars and shops. But, no, 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 and we did bring them in, my bag's full of toys, but no, she just wants the car keys. Guys, I'm pulling a prank on Esme. Yeah, Esme's so, pulling a prank. No, I'm pulling a prank. Oh, sorry, Isabel's <laughs> pulling a prank. So, sorry. So, um, Esme got her hair cut recently, right? And she said to me, Is I'll send you all these inspo pics so that when you get there for your appointment, you can show her, like, I want this, I want this, I want this. Yeah. So, uh, so literally, oh. just before my appointment, I said, Esme, I said, what hairstyle did you ask for? Please. Um, she didn't. She didn't reply all day until 10 a.m. this morning. So the next day. Next, so, so the next day. Is it? She got, is it too late, Bestie Boo? So I said, "What do you want now? You've ruined my day. I couldn't even get it cut right. I didn't have any inspo pics, so I had to leave it long." And she put, "You're an idiot. You should have just asked that you wanted a butterfly cut, layers, anything?" Question mark. So I just replied back to her. <laughs> I didn't know what to ask for. I planned it so it's still long. It's not the same length, but it's only got trimmed. Because I didn't know what to ask for. I didn't have any inspo pics. So I'm just gonna come over because my hair's still long. 
but it's not. It's and not. it's gone, it's all gone. I've only just noticed, oh, one minute. I've only just noticed for the first time. It's okay, Mina, sit down, darling. Uh, your tattoo, since, since you got it done. I've only just noticed it for the first ever time. Cute. Okay, so Chris just nailed the knock to the owner of the restaurant out. <laughs> he was at the toilet and he opened the door and she was still behind the door. Um, yeah. She's a I know, she's been, she's honestly, I don't know, she's just been a little Ted today. She's is not the one. Look how grown up she is though. Look at her just sat there with us. It's so cute. She's got a little dress on. We've got little Mila. Yeah. What are you having for lunch? Um. Sit down on your chair, remember? Dog. Cheese on top, close. A cheese sandwich. Yeah. So what are you having? Cheese sandwich. Cool, yeah. <laughs> Clever girl. Cheese sandwich. And you're having a cheese sandwich too, and Isabel's gone for. Yeah. Isabel's looking Asian. extra beautiful. I can't see your eyes though. Because of the light. <laughs> there we go. Because of the light. Um, so Isabel, what are you having? Cajun chicken skewers. No, I can't see your eyes. You, you got to talk to me from the side. Cajun chicken skewers. <laughs> I'm only joking. Cajun chicken skewers. Chris is fuming. He's gone for a tuna sandwich. He didn't see the Cajun chicken skewers. Did you not notice when Isabel was ordering them? Yeah, yeah I was looking at the menu thinking, where's that? Oh, she must have seen something I didn't see. I didn't know it's from the special board over there. Isabel from the specials board. I bet they've not made it yet. Who's the yeah. price of the line? I think they will, know, especially the chips they're as well. That's the time. Well, I'll eat the chips. <laughs> I'm often for eating it. You've got some like, some nice like, truffle and parmesan and truffles on the bed. Chips. chips. Yeah. It's back to steak, so it's like we have to enter shop with Yeah, we had pizza yesterday. It was homemade pizza, and my. Oh! Guy, no, stop, we need to take if a minute to talk about the pizza. healthy, that was a healthy pizza. No, we need to take a minute to talk about the pizza I made yesterday. So, it was. We all made our own oh, pizzas. Yes. In fact, I took a video clip of it, I'm going to insert it now. Is it? Basically, mine, everyone was choosing all the toppings, there was like 8 million toppings. Mine, I decided to do like a buffet. Buffet on top. So, <laughs> I basically did like quarters of pizza, but all my quarters were different. So, one was like salmon. An artichoke. One was I can't remember now. Barbecue bacon, pepperoni. One was sun-dried tomatoes with mozzarella balls. They were just all different. I did all different, and it was so good. It was genuinely the nicest pizza I've ever had in my whole life. It was good. You guys made your own pizzas, didn't you? Yeah, two of playing with like cups of water. Mila, really get your hand out of the cup of really, water, no, darling. No, 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 no. Why do kids really, do that? Really why do they stick the whole hand in the cup and then start sucking their fingers? Seriously, why? <laughs> just drink the drink. Um, and what did I go for? What have I just gone for? Um, Ham and caramelised onion chutney open sandwich. That's what I went for. Oh, if Chris wasn't fuming before, <laughs> it definitely is fuming now. Look how so yummy. That looks like the nicest meal ever. Mm. Even I'm. Even I'm jealous of that as well. That looks so good. Izzy, I'll edit your thumbnail for you if you swap me. I'll edit your thumbnail! <laughs> <laughs> I said you can try some. No, no, no we don't want to try it, Isabel. You want to I want the whole thing. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> this is my sandwich. It looks so good. So, so yummy and delicious. And then, oh, this is Chris's. He's got a tuna, he's got his chips. And then Jason Mila, I've got delicious tuna sa uh, cheese yeah. sandwiches. Yeah. Are they good? Yeah. And some chips to share as well. Are you sharing? <laughs> Do you like yourself a sandwich? Are you happy when you're eating? Are you partial to a little sandwich? <laughs> Have you got half a sandwich down your dress? I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna fish down there. I'm gonna leave you to it. Okay. <laughs> She's loving it. Honestly, this is the nicest. Most. Look at the state of me. I'm such a. <laughs> it can't take me anywhere. That's just the fat off the meat. But it's. It's so juicy and delicious and flavoursome and gorgeous and nice. Really good. And we got. Look, it's so quiet in here. Look. In fact, we're the only ones. Please. Please. Yeah, it's busy downstairs. But when you're rocking, when you've got all these children, they're like, yeah, let's put them in the back. <laughs> Out the way. Let's put them out the way. Suits me. <laughs> have you seen the cake? <laughs> Aurora, have you seen the cake? She's like, no, I'm going to finish off my crumbs. We just got some cake. Let's go sit down, sweetheart, on your bum bum. We just ordered 
some lemon cakes for dessert. It looks so delicious. Yummy. She seems happier now. You happy? Are you happy? Oh, <laughs> so cute. Do you just have a hungry tummy? Mm. Was one whole week to pick nine yes. up? Yes, we have. Thank you. Yeah, I have. Thank you so much. That was gorgeous. Oh, glad you enjoyed it. It's nice. Me. Thank you. I said to Chris, give her half a wee to pick with, for breakfast because she's just been having like egg and toast and things like that. So I was like, what can we give her that's like not, you know, what, just quick and easy? So I was like, give her half a wee to pick. And then he came upstairs and he was like, she ate the whole thing. And I was like, why did you give her a full one? I said just half. And he was like, no, that girl was not done with just half a wheat pick. And I was like, there's no way. Like a whole wheat pick is quite a lot for a, for a baby. And then this morning I realised what you meant when I fed her the wheat pick. And I was, I, I, I did a whole one and I warmed it up in the microwave. And I was like, there's no way she's going to eat all this. And she did. She ate the whole lot. <laughs> she ate the whole lot. And then she fed again after it. She fed like half an hour, 20 minutes, half an hour before I gave her the wheat pick. And then she wanted to feed straight after it as well. And she Washing ate the some milkies. Yeah. It's so sweet. You're a little Ted, aren't you? Are you making a mess? Hey? <laughs> you got a mouthful. <laughs> so I did really want to take Jason Mither to the park after we'd been for dinner, but the weather had other ideas. Yeah, the weather's just having none of it. So back home we are. What? Is it hard? Is it hard? Yeah. Are you struggling a bit with this one? Yeah. Okay. Boring. Pardon? Boring. It's boring? Yeah. It's not boring. It it's not. It says. It's not boring. It says boring. No, it's not. It says. you're funny. You are. Come here, look at me and tell me a story. No, oh. oh, do you not think it's boring anymore? No, do you like the game? Oh, we got a runaway. We got a runaway ball. Good girl, me there. now gonna stop. Have you got me a story? Um, Who's coming home tomorrow? Um, I don't know. Yay! You're so excited. Daddy's back? Yeah. He did go out this morning, didn't he? Yeah. Mila came out of bed and said, where's JC? Where's Daddy? That's what you said, didn't you? Yeah. And they'd oh, gone out to JC's appointment that went very, very well. I think Chris said he updated you, but not in depth. The long story short is that it's near his head. The patch treatment. That... Okay, you just put them anywhere you want. The patch treatment's working really well. Um, and it's to go back in August, which is absolutely great. It's working really well and there's massive improvement in his eye. He was well impressed. Oh no, he's got an appointment. Where's his next appointment? He's still got another appointment to go to next week. What was the difference between the two appointments? One was a... Today was the eye test. The testing and then he sees the doctor. Yeah, so next week he goes and sees the consultant. But the, but the test today went really, really well. Yeah! and he was so impressed that he could actually control his eye movement which is really good so that's really really awesome and Jace is great he's got a new patch haven't you Jace? the spider-man one i think we're going to end the vlog here because today is a bit of a two day and one we started filming yesterday morning we've ended this evening um or should i say this afternoon but we're not actually going to be doing anything i've just put some washing on and i'm going to do some laundry because i've got a laundry pile of washed clothes in the laundry room that's about as high as me not quite but you know it's a, a large pile i need to sort out aurora's nappies and all of those that have just been washed and... yeah and then aurora's room is also a bit of a mess so i need to go in there and just just with clothes and things i need to go and clean it up in there aurora as i said before has been a little bit fussy today i think she's going through like a six month lead so i think after i've played this with them but she's actually been really good right now she's in the jumper room but you can definitely tell she's rubbing her eyes she's about to cry i can actually tell See? I literally can tell when she's about to cry. Um, she's about to cry, so I'm going to just do everything I've got to do today, chores wise, and I'm just going to go and snuggle up on the sofa with her for the rest of the day. Give her some cuddles, give her some love, watch some TV, and have a bit of a chill and look forward to.
Mommy. You want to sit on the sofa like a big girl and watch TV? Yeah. Oh. Eating pizza? Yeah. So random. I look forward to Esme and Isla coming home tomorrow. I literally we can't wait to see them and give them both a squeeze. Thank you all so much for watching yesterday's and today's vlog in one. And we'll see you back here tomorrow at 5pm. Good night, guys. Mm -hmm. Bye.